Good morning. It's the 23rd of April, 2020. My name is Mark Pesci, and welcome to the next 100 seconds. Eradication. This is the word that no one dare utter, yet everyone wants to think is possible. At the current rate, in Australia, we will have approximately one or maybe zero cases a day every single day going forward. Does that mean we've eradicated it? I don't think anyone really wants to put all their money down on that call. It means, however, that any outbreaks would be caught immediately and kept very carefully under control. So if not eradication, it is at least management. What does that mean? Well, it may mean that we can go back to things being almost normal. I don't know if we'll ever get back to large meetings again until there's a vaccine. I don't know if I'll be able to go see the Swans play with 30,000 other fans at the SCG. I would like to, but we will be able to get back to most of our lives, most of the economy, and figure out what happens next. Eradication is the way forward, but of course, we need an enormous testing capacity, which we're building here by degrees in Australia, which everyone else will need, and we'll need diligence, and for the moment, we'll need to keep the borders closed with any country that doesn't have that data hasn't eradicated. And that right now, that's a really short list. Maybe Taiwan, maybe New Zealand, probably some of the states in Oceania. So for a moment, we're going to live inside of a bubble. But that bubble inside of there will be open and mostly free. And that's something to look for. Eradication might not be possible, but it is an aspiration. And that's 100 Seconds.